Hello beer fans, Hero Brewing Company here. Welcome to my beer library where I do beer reviews. And um, also I make beer, I do a beer vlog, and all that. So it's, it, and I try a bunch of different other stuff like ciders and seltzers and cocktails and everything like that. So today we are going to be trying an Italian beer. Uh, I do apologize if I butcher this because I probably will. So I'll show you the bottle first. So there we go. That's the brand. Now a buddy of mine has a uh, um, a theory about Italian beer and Irish beer. He says Irish beer tastes delicious uh, because the food sucks. It's true. I'm Irish. I mean, we know how to make potatoes <laughs> and meat. Okay. And then he says Italian beers suck because their food is so delicious. So we're gonna try that out today. This is. Semen Dorato beer, 5% alcohol by volume, and it is Sicilian taste lager beer. So it says beer de pure molto premium. Yep. So this is a product of Italy. Let's give her a go. I do like the design, which I'll show you. It's on the cap as well. Sema Dorato beer. It's got like this lady with three legs. Top. Unless, it's, of course, it's a guy. It could be a guy. It's not hot. Alright, let's get into this lager. So this is an Italian lager. A little bit of a lighter color than our lagers. I guess it depends on what lager. It smells bad. So it smells like if a skunk sprayed your leg and then you drank a beer right after. My buddy gave me this because um, he knows I do these reviews. I'm kind of thinking he left it out in the sun for a week and then peed on it and then a skunk sprayed it. Then he gave it to me. I'm just kidding. Uh, but it does smell skunky, yes. Um, I'm not kidding about that. It smells horrible. Let's try it. It doesn't taste as horrible as it smells. But I think my buddy's theory about the Irish food being crappy, but we got good beer, and the Italian food being great, but they have crappy beer, I'm beginning to think that's true. So, it does taste very different, I'll, I'll say that. And the color seems to have changed. It's like a darker pea now, a dark pea color, where, it's, where when I was pouring it, it seemed like a straw pea. It kind of tastes like skunky beer. Um, you do get some, uh, some like hop, flavors in there but they're kind of uh, not good hops like not fresh hops it doesn't taste like um, you know it could be me it could be my taste buds but uh, not a fan so we're gonna put this in the Italian lager or Ita let's put it in the Italian beer category they can have their own category it's fine uh, Italian beer category zero being the worst hundred being the best I'm going to give you a 55. Uh, um, I probably couldn't drink two of these because it tastes that bad. Um, but I don't want to say that you're a failure because I don't know what you're supposed to taste like. So, the skunkiness smell is not going away. But the taste is uh, getting a little better. It kind of just tastes like a weird lager I mean you can taste the lager taste it just um, it's like covered up by weirdness if that makes any sense so basically um, like I said I do these reviews leave in the comments if you want me to try a beer if you've ever had this beer um, leave it in the comments tell me what you thought of it and uh, we'll go from there 
Um, it says best before 1219. It is literally July. So um, it's not it's not nasty beer. He just bought it from Aldi. I know my friend. So if you ever had this beer, let me know. Leave it in the comments. Try something you never had before. Share. Subscribe. Duh. Like. Leave a comment either way. Um, leave a comment if you want me to try something you, you think that is great. You think that is crappy. Or if you've tried this. Alright. Cheers.